And welcome back, this is Balascoba with more Let's Play Monkey Island 2, LeChuck's Revenge, Special Edition. I am joined, as always, by the bearded Guybrush Threepwood. When we last left off, we, well, we need to get Stan, the used coffin dealer, out of our way. And I was a little unsure how to do that because I had definitely skipped a step. What we need to do is head back in here. I don't think we ever showed this off. We did, because this guy had a smaller beak. Uh, I need to purchase some things in here. Well, I I'd like to buy this well-polished old saw. I need the okay, saw. Dokey. That'll be 25 pieces of eight. Sounds good to me. Okay, I'll take it. Thank you. And I will also require the ship's horn for- I'd like to buy this ship's horn. Other All things. Alrighty. That'll be 40 pieces of eight. I'm going broke real okay, damn fast. I'll take it. Let me get you one from Overstock. Hooray! One from an online Here website. There you go. Thank you. Weird. Mirror, can I get that? He likes it where it is. Of course he does. So I cannot purchase that just yet. So let's get out of here. And we actually need to go back to Woodtick now that I have where the Where do you want to go? Let's just go to Scab Island. Uh, I will be cutting these out from now on luckily they do let me do that otherwise i'd just be there forever okay let's move on we need to actually avoid what i actually need which is in the woodsmith shop i need his hammer and nails so that i can do it and stand sounds so morbid that i need to to lock him in a coffin like that but first i need to I mean, we're just being insanely mean around here. We do have some stuff around here to look at, though. Par parrot chow? It has a picture of a parrot on the front. Thank you for pointing that out to me. Uh, what about the leaf? Capsized charters. Glass bottom boat for sightseeing or special interest voyages. There's a picture of her on it. Fair enough. Tell me about the hanky. When the tears come, shouldn't you be prepared? Stan's oh. previously owned coffins. Right. I got it from him. It may be old, but it's still shiny and sharp. Fair enough. And tell me about the horn. Made in Hong Kong. Made in Hong Kong. <laughs> Alright, we need to use the saw on the pirate's peg leg. <laughs> this stuff would never occur to me naturally. D luckily, you know, I have... <sighs> I have ways of finding this information out because seriously, this would never occur to me. Let's just get out of here then. Sabotage done. Someone get a doctor! Surely the doctor will help him out with this. And we're just gonna get out of here. We need to head back to the woodsmith shop because now the woodsmith is no longer there because he apparently is the doctor for the peg leg. So let's go ahead and grab the things that I need. Hammer, nails, I think that is it. What's the sign say? It says, out on house call. Please come again. Can I take the calendar? I can't. He's lacquered it onto the wall. That's kind of creepy, actually. Okay, that is all that I need here. So let's get out of here with my hammer and nails in tow. Unfortunately, it is kind of a walk back to uh, the ship. If you remember, it is... What is it? Isn't it down here on the peninsula? No, it's up here, Dredge Ship. So it's not too bad of a walk the peninsula. Where do you want to go? was way down there but it is not anymore so back to scab island or sorry back to booty island they do not do the little thing anymore which is nice because that was taking way too long let's just go back check it in. out yes cruises, cruises. let's head well, back in here well well i knew you'd come back my customers always do eventually Right, that's just weird. I'd just like to browse, Stan. Actually, I'd just like to browse. Sorry. Health regulations prohibit me from allowing uncertified persons free access to used and term paraphernalia. Oh, that's, shucks. That's gross. Kind of. Do you do funerals? Do you do funerals? Of course we do funerals! And not just those somber, all-black, three-handkerchief affairs. We do it in a rowdy Mardi Gras style with music and dancing and pallbearer races. Pallbearer like races? I say we put the fun in funerals. Fun. <laughs> You're kind of crazy. 
All right, could you show me that coffin again? Could you show me that coffin again? Yes, sirree. Good, solid construction on this baby. Keeps out the worms while your body firms. Oh, that's gross. Could you get in and show me how big it is again? Of course. All right. <laughs> this thing's bigger than my kitchen. Shut up. You know, a person's coffin should reflect you, their When station. you're in your inventory, you have as much time if as you you're want. thinking about one of those cheaper models, first ask yourself, isn't my loved one worth the best? I hear you knocking up there. That solid oak you're hearing. Yes, it sure is nice in here. Hey, I think the lid stuck. Um, excuse me, friend. Could you see if the clasp is closed on this thing? Uh, be there in a minute. Hello? It's locked. Is anybody out there? Oh, I can't steal from him too? Help! I can't get out of here. Fine, I'll just okay. leave. A joke's a joke. Now get me out of here. Are you still out there? <laughs> no. Hello? I am long gone. Glass bottom boat. Shut up, Stan. Sunken galleons. Okay, so... You might be wondering what we've been doing all this for. It seems like we've been just randomly doing random yeah, things. But this all does lead to one thing in particular. We have now in our possession a crypt key uh, that we could not grab before. So let's head to the cemetery, see if I can do something with this crypt key. Here's a crypt. Let's use a key on it. This looks kind of creepy, actually. Stan's Cozy Crypts. A place to spend eternity, not a fortune. Still very creepy. Use, it, use the crypt key in the crypt. We will see if that works out well for me. Sometimes it doesn't. It does! Hooray! Makes sense. Let's head inside. Here we can find some coffins. Let's look at them. It's inscribed with a quote. Happiness is a warm manatee. Ew. Hmm. What do we have inside? Ashes. Ooh, looks like human ashes. Should I pick them up? I picked them up. Silty. <laughs> and I got concept art for that. Hooray! It pretty much looks the same. What does this one say? Kiss me. I've got scurvy. That's kind of gross. I don't think there's anyone of interest in there. I don't think there's anyone of interest in there. Wait, after all this, I didn't even need the book? Violets are blue, roses are red, we're coming aboard. Prepare to eat lead. I don't think there's anyone of interest in there. Mouthwash. We don't need no stinking mouthwash. I don't think there's anyone of interest in there. It appears to me that they have uh, made it so I can't really do anything. Look at the Silty. Ashes. Silty. Yes, of course they are. So... I have the famous pri pirate quotations. Famous pirate here. quotations. Happiness is a warm manatee. Rap scallion. That's Kiss the me. one. I've got scurvy. Barney Gout. Darn! Commander Buttonhead. Violets are blue. Roses are red. We're coming aboard. Prepare to eat lead. Old skunk eye. Mouthwash. We don't need no stinking mouthwash. Fester leech. And now we have the names of everybody that is here. It just pretty much went in order, which is kind of funny. Uh, obviously, who we need is Rap Scallion. So you could use that legitimately to find the right answer, or you could just guess and check, apparently, and it's the first one. That kind of makes me mad, because I went through a lot of trouble to get that book. So, let's take a look at, uh, I believe, The Joy of Hex. Have we ever read this? Probably not. The Joy of Hex. I think it's meant for advanced voodoo practitioners. The writing's way too technical for me. So, I think we know somebody that can deal with that. So, let's go ahead and find the voodoo lady, which means we need to get back on our coffin of floating. So, on to the coffin we go. And through the swamp once again. In search of the voodoo lady. Voodoo lady! I need to find out what's going on with Rapscallion. He had a map piece. And they're not letting me have the, rap, the, the map piece. So if you could figure out 
how, how to find out where it is using these ashes. That'd be appreciated, voodoo lady. Back again, Mr. Threepwood? I am. No, it's not the voodoo lady. I swear it was the voodoo lady. Uh, well, that's enough voodoo for me. Bye. So maybe, be it. Maybe it's something else here. Obviously, it's something with the voodoo. Can I look at the bottles? They're unlabeled. Unlabeled. How about these? Spider lungs. Spider lungs. Hey, there's one that sounded good. Where was it? No? You're not good. There. There. Ash to hey, life. That's just a display model. Can I have a real one then? Ash to life sounds fantastic. I've got the real stuff back here. That's one of my most powerful potions. I bet. It brings the dead back to life. I'll take I'll it. take it. There are some complications. It only works on ashes, and the resurrection is only temporary. That's yes. fine. You need to bring me a sample of the subject's ashes before I can mix you up a batch. I have the ashes of somebody I'd like resurrected right here. Bring them to me. What? Now, there's only one small problem. I forgot the recipe. What? It's been a long time. I don't have that cookbook anymore. I've got a book of voodoo recipes. Good. I am How prepared. How many crab scalps does it say to use? Thirteen. Good. That's just what I thought when I whipped up this experimental batch. Thanks. Remember, just a dabble do ya. I think I threw up in my mouth a little bit. So, now I think we need to head back to the crypt. Because that was not enough. Well, the, the ashes that we took was just enough, and it came in like a salt shaker, uh, the, to make the potion, but not enough to actually resurrect him. So, back to the crypt we go. I was prepared for once. <laughs> Hooray! I had everything that I needed, because backtracking kind of gets tedious after some time. And this is just to get one of the map pieces. Remember that there are four. We'll see how difficult the other three are. You don't always have to do this one first, but what are you going to do? Okay. Uh, yeah, let's cancel. And here's my Ash to Life. Use Ash it. Ash to Life. The uncremating cream. Now in a convenient powder. Oh, yeah. It's in a salt shaker. Wonderful. Use it on the coffin. And once again, we get a loading screen, which is weird for this. It has to load this. Oh, what the hell? 